My name is Boris Savo. I am a 22 year old uh, student at Cardiff University student, and I am currently a human resources assistant at Cobalt HR for Kerry Chan. I'm mainly responsible for operational HR activities, such as contract reviews, um, process manuals, staff handbooks, and more recently, I've been working on some developmental human resources activities, such as performance management sessions, sessions on typical conversations, and I'm also looking into working with directly with Carrie Chow on redundancies and maybe grievances and discipline procedural policy. As a student, I've always had this picture of an, in my mind of what it means to be a professional, of what professional qualities I need to bring, what mentality I need to bring, how I need to act in the workplace, how I need to engage in team, etc. Cobalt HR has enabled me to expand upon this understanding and to put it into practice. Um, it's confirmed some of my main expectations as to what it means to work in the workplace, uh, but it's also learned it's also enabled me to learn new things, such as working with individuals um, effectively, even with individuals with whom I don't share much in common personally, but professionally, we very much have, you know, we very much work hand in hand. And that's the main thing which Cobalt HR, well, one of the many things, but for me, a very important thing. Most individuals and most prefer human resource professionals specialize in one specific area, such as, for example, redundancies or recruitment. What I, and I'm given a golden opportunity to professionalize myself in all of these aspects simultaneously through the work which I do with Cobalt HR with Kerry Chan. And I found, find that invaluable. That is something which I'm perfectly aware that you know, not everybody has on their agenda. Not everybody has access to um, such short notice and at the same time very comprehensive professional uh, development in these areas. It's something which I treasure greatly and something which I find very valuable and want to preserve. So that's one of the main, one of the most valuable aspects uh, of Cobalt HR for me. How to put this? The team is brilliant. <laughs> that is to put it lightly. Um, coming back to one of the, uh, one of, <laughs> coming back to uh, one of my previous answers on, previous, on uh, your last questions about working in a team with individuals with whom I don't necessarily share uh, and uh, share s um, have similarities on a personal basis. That in and of itself demonstrates that the our profession our professionalism, our qualifications, the expertise which we bring to the workplace can bridge any and all um, differences, personal differences, individual differences. Can um, that these can be amended and the, this enables us to work more effectively as a team uh, to reach our goals and to reach our deadlines more effectively. Because you don't really think about this and sometimes employees take this for granted when you work very well in a team, but that is not necessarily the case across all um, workplaces, across all industries. And what we at Cobol HR, one of the things that we want to do and aspire to do is to teach individuals how to work more effectively in teams but until we get there we should i believe that we should appreciate this this aspect um i make use of my daily exercise i go about running almost on a daily basis i'm out but i'm making sure that i keep that, that i stay that i keep uh, a good social distance between um pedestrians outside and making sure that you know, we keep, uh, I keep my fellow citizens safe, I'm contributing to the work of uh, NHS, uh, not making uh, the work of NHS staff uh, any more difficult than it already is. That's one of the things which I do. We like to work out uh, with uh, one of my flatmates uh, in our backyard. Sometimes she likes to go um, and we have some fun around that. There are whole there are a range of different things which we thought of 
doing at home, which we previously would not have conceived of if it wasn't for the pandemic, which is a positive born out of a negative, yeah. but from that perspective, we're making the most out of it.